Hey guys, welcome to another plugin tutorial. Today it's on locked items. Now, this is a useful plugin which allows you to create these lock chests and maybe add your friends to them if you want them to be able to get inside and see the items. So, how do we do this? Well, you can create a custom uh, crafting recipe, but by default, you need a chest in the middle and a U shape of golden ingots, and on the top, you will have three iron ingots, and that will create your lock chest. Now, you can place it down. Uh, you can't put it next to a normal chest, however, but you can put two lock chests together to make a double lock chest, uh, and that's how you do that. So um, it works pretty similar to a normal chest. You can pop items in. It says in purple lock chest up here, and this normal chest says just chest. So uh, there are a few commands. So if we do forward slash locked items, um, we will see all of the commands. So we can obviously look at the version, check for updates, and we can actually permit a player. So um, what we can do is click view permitted while looking at a locked chest and I added my other account to uh, to this chest so we can unpermit him by doing unpermit and then his username and that will get rid of him there and as you can see he is no longer permitted to go in the chest. And then you can uh, give player a locked chest if you really want to and you can see a player's locked chest. So uh, let's go with C and myself, and there we go. So I have one, and it's here, <clears throat> and we can also give one to myself as well if we can't be bothered to craft it. There we go. So that is how you use it in-game. Um, it's very straightforward and easy to use. We are going to have a quick look at the YML files to see what you can change in there. So here we are in the locked items uh, folder, and as you can see, there are four YML files. So permits and chests you don't need to worry about. Uh, but the language file, obviously, you can change any of this if you really want to. There's no need, you could add colors or format codes. But in the config, this is where you can change the recipe uh, and you can enable or disable it and have a chest limit as well. So uh, as you can see here, we have iron, we have gold, and we have chest. And these are the IDs for all those items. And what we can do, we can change the shape. So if you really wanted to, you could make it require more gold so in this case it would be a taller U shape with only one iron ingot um, or you could add some diamonds or whatever you want so that is how you um, edit it it's very straightforward uh, it's a simple plugin but really awesome subscribe like comment and I'll see you next time